Hello Libra, I'm Susie from the Gift to Two and this is your weekly read for the week of the 7th of October. My throat is a bit croaky so it might be a quicker read than usual but we're going to ask the Angel Spirit Guides for Libra. What would you like Libra to know about this week of the 7th of October for Libra please? Oh this, I'm, see it was poking out Libra. Twin Flame, an eye to eye love, Angel Spirit Guides, a soulmate. Angel spirit back in the What would you like Libra to know? Okay, so Libra, bottom of the deck we have the judgment reverse. Something's not healing. Judgment up, so upright is a karmic. Is it's knowing that nothing's perfect, but and it's healing. Things are coming out of the closet to heal, but things are left in the closet. It's lack of judgment, lack of something. Maybe you're judged wrongly. Maybe someone judged you wrongly. So they've got this two of cups with the Queen of Swords. So this is like a twin flame eye to eye union with the Queen of Swords. This this woman, this person, is not taking any BS. She's she's got clarity now over this this union, um, and it's the truth. It's like the truth or nothing. Uh, the chariot up here is like you're you're having a victory by pulling in by by traveling or moving um, and pulling in some balance here. It's like movement forward. There's a victory in moving forward. Um, hearts are beginning to heal. There's no longer a time of waiting. You can't wait anymore for a home or a foundation or a marriage or this love is upside down. It's like there's, there seems to be a victory because you're taking, you're balancing your... It's like you're taking movement to heal your heart. You're doing it now. You're not waiting around. You're not seeing it from another perspective. It's like, I don't want this partnership. I don't... Uh, I don't want to choose... Because you're feeling unearthed about money, you're feeling un unearthed, someone's angry about a foundation being unearthed. You're wanting to invest in something that is, or take a gamble on something and go somewhere more peaceful. You want to invest in something more peaceful, uh, something at a distance, there's travel here, you could be going away with someone at the end of this week, it's like you go away and then, or you go away to meet someone or talk to somebody. There's lots of communication once you get this peace. Swift arrows of love are coming for you, but there is like this battle of wills here, who's going to back down first? Um, you've worked really hard to get where you are, um, these people want your platform you've got a certain victory here from the past they want they want to bring you down to their level and it's like no 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 <laughs> it's like you go away you're going away with someone or someone's coming towards you and you want peace but then there's this fight Maybe when you get back. Um, it's like this Queen of Swords is not having it anymore. And that's your, your energy. It's like your air. You just don't want any bullshit anymore. You, you've met this person eye to eye. You want to get towards them. You want victory with them. 
the swords are coming out of your heart to heal. Maybe there was an end into a relationship, but something's healing now. Um, you can't wait around any longer because your foundation or these the, the job you were in or the people you're around, um, you're not going on this voyage now. You're not getting this job now. Um, so what happens is you feel that there's no love here because you don't have the money. So that makes you think, well, I've got £7,000. Where am I going to invest that? Because now I don't have the foundation or the home that I wanted or the love that I wanted. Where do I do? What do I do now? So you think, right, I've got my own problems. My gut's telling me to go and get some peas to go off into um, for the weekend or something like that. And while you're there, someone could come from overseas at a distance. You could be visiting somebody. There's lots of communication. There's a, there's some kind of passion here, lots of passion. Um, but there's still this not backing down off a pedestal because you've worked so hard to get up here and people are trying to will you down or will you will you back or something like that. There's eight, there's, eight, there's communication, then it goes back to the seven, which is the battle... before you get back on the boat. There's lots of communication, lots of who's gonna back down, who's gonna back down first. It's like, no, your name's not, you're not coming in. I've worked so hard to get here. Let's ask the romance angels, what would you like Libra to know? Forgiving and learning, as you release the heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like? Libra to know about this week of the 7th of October. Libra, please, Libra, 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 Libra. Let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Give, getting to know each other, as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bonds deepen, soulmate, yes, this is your soulmate, and free yourself, it's time to take back control of your life, yes, you're taking back control, um, and healing your heart, you're not waiting around any longer for a job, or a contract, or a group of people, because no one's making a decision in love. There's lack of security, lack of money. Um, it could be a, a king of uh, a Capricorn or something. They're, they're unearthed or angry when they don't have money. They could be offering you uh, a house to stay in or something like that. Or you, there's not, you don't feel secure where you are, so you're contemplating going to live somewhere else. And you just want these peaceful waters. And whilst you're going away, someone might say to you, I'm coming. There's so, so much communication. And a clear stress of fruitful activity with this person. But there's still sort of a boundary being held up. They're still standing your ground on something. But it's saying take control back of your life, forgiving learning, soulmate, getting to know each other, get to know someone. There's lots to communicate, get to know someone. And when you reveal your secrets and you bring down those barriers, the bond is deepening. Let go of the control, let go of this boundary, let the, let the walls down so that you can go back to this nice eight of wands communication angel spirit guides universe what would you like libra to know about this week of the 7th of october release and surrender as we shower you blessings of a radiant love open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped 
in your hands, within your hands, open your hands, arms and heart to our love and assistance. So it's that letting go of control, getting to know someone, um, letting to go of how you want things to turn out. Get to know someone. And it's saying it's your soulmate. Take back control of your life. Your unicorn, get out of this pen. And um, let's ask the angels. Two more cards, please, for Libra. I'm helping you heal physical challenges in yourself and others. You are a healer like me. So there might be some factor where you can't... Choose... You're healing this heart. This this swords are coming out of your heart. You're healing. There's no longer time to see things from other people's points of view. You can't wait around any longer for these people around you right now. Don't have your best interest or they're, they're fighting to get what you want. And it's like once it's like you do it all on your own. And then these people come in at the last minute and go, oh, actually, um, can you do this for me? And it's like, no. It's like you're having it's like when you've baked the bread, people come in and eat the bread. I think because you have this eight of wands, this travel, this person or this person comes towards you or this all this communication, there's love here. It makes it easier for you to stand your ground with these people that didn't help you get somewhere where well, you got there yourself. Am I making sense? Angel, spirit, flight, universe. What would you like? I know it says let go of control issues, but because they're upside down, those people that should be helping you, the people that should be in this promotion or in this marriage or in this house or in this shared collective to help you get the fleece aren't helping you. They're not be they're not helping you choose love. Um they're angry and ungrounded. They haven't got any money. They're not helping you financially. So what you have got, you need to invest very, very wisely. And you might need to be go somewhere and say, right, I've got six swords of my worries. This is my bag. I know I'm not great. I know I need to heal. I know I've got this worry, that worry. But as soon as you do that, you're able to communicate. And there's lots of passion and arrows of, of creativity and someone coming at distance for, for you let's see angels and then these people try to come back in at the end and say well where is libra they've gone off and they're having they're getting to know somebody we want we want what you've got and you're like no i freed myself and I'm getting to know someone. Angels, spirit guides, what are you doing? <laughs> Libra. What would you like Libra to know? Angels, spirit guides, universe. What would you like Libra to know? Victory. Your desire is coming to fruition. Keep up the good work. It's like you invest in something else, somewhere else, doing someone else. <laughs> Look, let me ask again, Libra. Patience. Your dreams are blooming more rapidly than you realise. Still, they need nurturing and patience. So um, it's eventful. Let's just say you're healing this week um, and you can heal other people. But be patient. There's a victory coming. It's just working out how on where, where to take the gamble and where to go. It could be a new home you're contemplating. Uh, be patient. There's a victory coming. Uh, and um, someone could be angry here because they don't have enough funds. You could help them out with funds. And then go away on your own and meet someone or someone's from distance is coming towards you. The eight, well, I love the eight of ones. It's the dolphins on the crest of a wave. It's just like... It flows. But then for some reason, all of a sudden, that guard goes up again. OK, 
communication. Take care, Libra. I hope I've helped you. Please like, share and subscribe and I will speak to you soon. Bye-bye.